Welcome to President Trump Breaking News YouTube channel. Please subscribe and don't forget to press the bell icon button next to subscribe button to get daily latest news alert. Click on the CC button to get automatic subtitle in video if you facing the difficulties in listening sound. Breaking News Report North Korea preparing catastrophic attack. The United States has been on watch over North Korea since their threats amped up early this summer. After repeated verbal threats and the testing of their missiles, the situation is heating up to an all-time high. Now a new fear is bubbling to the surface. According to the Daily Mail, Kim Jong-un could be preparing biological weapons such as smallpox, anthrax, and cholera. The potential loss of life could be in the tens of thousands if he should decide to attack. Some experts are now suggesting that their main target could be places where U.S. troops are currently stationed. News of this potential attack comes shortly after the North Korean government declared President Donald Trump to be a hooligan and equated him to a lunatic with his finger over a nuclear button. A recent report came out of the Belfer Center of Harvard University's Kennedy School explaining exactly why they believe that North Korea is planning a biological attack. The report quoted the South Korean Defense Ministry as follows, North Korea has 13 types of biological weapons agents which it can weaponize within 10 days, and anthrax and smallpox are the likely agents it would deploy. This quote is something that has caused U.S. military to be on steady watch. As the report continues, it explains just how much anthrax would be needed to cause a catastrophe, particularly in a densely populated area. A few kilograms of anthrax, the report reads, released into a dense city could kill 50% of the population. If used on a large scale, these weapons can cause not only tens of thousands of deaths, but also create panic and paralyze societies. In a society like the United States, we could be spending months perhaps even years recovering from such a devastating attack. At the same time, North Korea has been issuing threats and mockery towards the United States and North Korea's neighbor, South Korea. Their threats focus around insulting President Trump and implying that he is inciting war. They seem to have forgotten their multiple threats on Guam, or the U.S. mainland. At the same time, President Trump has said formally and via his Twitter that he wants nothing more than to resolve this issue with North Korea diplomatically. A North Korean government-run media report says that dignitaries of White House, and state and defense departments of the U.S. are having a hard time cooling Trump overheated with a war fever. But only the South Korean puppet forces are fanning out the lunatic fingering a nuclear button. All the while, Kim continues to threaten the United States on a daily basis. This is causing the U.S. military to stay on watch just in case North Korea does try to pull off something that could devastate the U.S. As a result of North Korea's threats, according to Newsmax, the U.S. Air Force now has a whole fleet of B-52 bombers on 24-hour alert ready to launch on command. Each one of these bombers is capable of carrying nuclear weapons. While everyone would love for this to come to a peaceful end, North Korea does not seem to want it to happen that way. If peace cannot be achieved, the best measure is to continue to try to defuse the volatile situation and be on high alert for incoming attacks. So, what you think about this news please share this news to your social contacts and comment in below comment section. And don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to press the bell icon button next to subscribe button to get latest news alert daily. Thanks for watching this.